got to leave the cage Every day is a different stage We're pushing away our problems today Walking the roads of destiny Wise men power, yes we climb in the tower Every hour, yes we get in Greetings friends and colleagues It's classic Beautiful day today, man. Just out here, man, taking a swim, enjoying the cold water. Feel good, man. Just the skin feels good, the body feels good. Connecting with the mother, connecting with the earth, connecting with the water elements. Such a beautiful thing, man. I mean, you feel good, man. And like I was telling you how the benefits of when you do these kind of things, when you go out and you don't care, man, you, you enjoy yourself. Enjoy it, man, because you have to get used to the spiritual side of life, the more con the connection with earth type of life, man. You've, you've got to get yourself out of those situations, man, those boxes, man. You've got to do that, and it's just a, a beautiful thing when you come out, man, and you, ah, you take in the air, man. You feel good, man. It's like take a deep breath, and you feel that, and you know that you're getting better. You know that life is changing. You know that you're doing the best that you can with all your addictions with with life and whatever situation that you're going through you're overcoming it damn it feels good man it just it just feels that yes and you feel like you walk in the right routes you know you feel like you walk in the right routes but what I've been getting from people is they've been asking me how or I, what I'm getting is that a lot of people feel bad about the fact that they keep relapsing and they keep going back to porn, they keep going back to masturbation and they feel bad about that and they say yes I'm on this journey but I keep going back and I keep fapping and I have so much anxiety and I have all these things that it's like how do I overcome these things like this is what I'm saying man what what you need to focus on is that it's all about knowing that when you were a child and when you were learning to walk, did you not slip a few times? You slipped a lot of times. What did you keep doing? You kept getting back, right? You kept getting back up to walk. You didn't, you didn't think you had an option. You said, I'm going to get back up and walk. You slipped, you got back up. You slipped, you got back up. You keep slipping, but you keep getting back up. That's what you did as a child. And whatever that you did growing up, whenever that you failed, you just kept trying. But it seems that we have somehow been conditioned to feel like when we when we slip or when things don't go our way, when we want something from our bodies and it doesn't happen and we feel bad about it. And we say, I'm such a failure, I'm such a loser and all of this to make you feel bad about your situation. But it's not true, man. Because you have to go through the fire before you can see the good days, man. And it's all right to slip. It's all right to go back. And you're gonna experience anxiety because you're still dealing with emotional problems that you, you were keeping in, man. You were keeping in a whole lot of emotional issues, a whole, a whole lot of emotional traumas. Those things don't go away, they're still there. And it's now they're coming up to the surface on your face for you to face it. Because that's what the wise man route is. You facing your situations, man. Because remember, the sexual energy is the most powerful energy on this planet that you, you could experience. Think about it. All elements on this world I mean, all the interactions, you look around, it's all sex, it's all male and female principles that makes everything. So don't you, even you are male and female. You are andro and and androgynous, man. I mean, that's what you are. You have both male and female principles in your body, man. You're both of them, actually. And when you can start to realize that, you start to realize how beautiful that it is when you you know you experience whatever because it doesn't matter what you really experience because you can only get better when you when you learn to play an instrument when you learn to do whatever you don't know how to do that first you fail huh? that's what you did you failed you keep failing but you get back up you keep getting back up you keep trying again you keep trying again until it becomes something effortless man and that's what you're aiming for effortlessness the wise man route is the route towards effortlessness. When we don't give efforts, when we fail, and when you keep your power within, 
That's what starts to happen, man. Your sexual energy liberates you, man. You feel you feel unified, man. But it does take time. It does take your you know you're gonna slip. But when you slip now, you have to have a your intent is to overcome it. When you watch porn, if you fapping, but your intent should be different. That's the that's the difference. Your intent has changed now. So you're not viewing it the same way. You're viewing it now. You're asking your questions, yourself questions. Why am I addicted to this? You're asking yourself questions now. Even when you flip on porn or whatever, there there are specific scenes in the in the in the flicks that you just keep watching over and over and over. There's something about that. Don't just think it's just oh I, I just like this kind of thing. There's a reason why you like that type of scene, that type of you know image, that type of. That's all you keep watching. The same exact kind of porn or whatever there's a reason behind that man now you have to look at intent and say what is that why is it that I like this type of thing why is it that I like only this type of scene or only watching this type of thing in the, in the, in the flicks there's something that's drawing your attention in and you got to start looking at these things man that's what it is you just keep focusing on these things you change your intent when you change your intent that's the route towards freedom because your intent is not the same so really even if you're watching it you're really not the same person watching it you're changing now. You're becoming something totally new. And because you're becoming totally new, you're not the same person watching it, man. Because you're viewing it from a different perspective. And if you view it from a different perspective, you're going to be free. Because you're not viewing it from the same, oh my gosh, this is she, this is so, ah, she is so pretty, blah, blah, blah. You may say she is so pretty, but now you view it and you say, actually, I'm actually trying to overcome this now. And I'm viewing it differently. And there's a reason why I'm into this. And there's a reason why you like the specific type of women that you like in the, in the flicks. There's a reason why you like the, there, there are specific types of women that you keep going back and forth and watching them over and over. And there are specific things that you, because it's all, oh, there's something that your body is telling you. Look at it seriously, man. Ask yourself questions on why do I like this? Why is it that I only focus on this? Why is it that I only, you know what I'm saying? You gotta start viewing these things differently so that way you're not rough on yourself. You know that you're only getting better, but when you process of getting better, you gotta overcome things. You gotta ask yourself questions. You know, and the emotions are still there. You may get that trigger, but it's all an emotional thing. You're dealing with that. This is why I told you the practice of meditation, the process of clearing your mind, man. Just learning to know, you know, discipline your body. Like I'm getting in, into the, I'm learning yoga now. Practicing yoga, man. You know what I'm saying? Practicing just the discipline of... Now, yoga is not this thing that you... It's all about the body and all of that. And you may go and click on yoga and what you're going to see is a whole lot of females wearing tight clothes again. You're going to say, oh my gosh, it's the same thing. So, uh, But you may look for yogas for men and start getting into that, man. Because what it is, yoga is not only um, stretching the body. Yoga is any form of discipline that's uh, mental mind, uh, the physical body, all of that. So religion is a yoga. Meditation is yoga. Um, yoga, just the tantric, the tantric systems of disciplining your body. It's all of that. You know, it's all unified. So it's just about disciplining the mind and body, man. And if you want to discipline the mind and body, you're gonna, you know, you gotta, you gotta go through ups and downs. But just know that, and don't be rough on yourself, and know that you, you're only getting better. That's what it is, man. That's why you're relapsing, man. You're relapsing because you're getting better. That's the answer. <laughs> That's what it is, man. And eventually you'll get to a point where your intent is so strong that if you relapse, you don't really care. You, it, because they don't have a hold on you anymore. You don't, you're not urgent to do it anymore. Such that now you can spend so much amount of days without even thinking about it. And you're like, oh, I, this just popped up again. And then you work on it again and again. And it just doesn't bother you. You become effortless, man. So that's what it is, man. So that's why you keep relapsing, man. Just know that you're getting better every single day and every single way. You're getting wiser and wiser and wiser. That's what it's about, man. So why you keep relapsing, man? You keep relapsing because you, you're getting better. And you're getting wiser. And you're getting more conscious. Your body's adapting. Your body's adapting to change. And that's a good sign. That's what it is, man. So, just know that you're getting better, man. Yes, you are. And as always, thank you for watching.